Welcome back to another YouTube vlog. Today we have heavy bench, heavy deadlifts. Um, we obviously we got life to live to. Who knows what goes on? You know, maybe maybe Barack Obama is gonna show up at the gym and be like, "You want to give you want to give a speech to the White House or some random shit." But um, if you guys don't know, if you don't follow my social medias, Dan Dotswol on everything. I am currently like dealing with a really weird injury right now. We got the painkillers right here. Like, I'ma just, I'ma thug that shit out. I'ma thug that shit out. Cause it's like, what other choice do I have but to thug that shit out? I need to get my workout in. You know what I mean? It's like, I wake up to work out. And if I can't work out, then why did I wake up? Anyways, what happened is I was deadlifting and I like hyper extended my neck. And ever since then, I've just been fucked. I think I strained something in my neck, but it just gives me, like, imagine an exertion headache, but, like, ten times worse. The whole day, your head's just pulsing. Like, even right now, I just woke up. All I did was eat my pre-workout meal, rice cakes, peanut butter, banana, and, like, my head's just pulsing. We don't see what I can get away with today. It is my week three, so it's, like... Second to last week, I'm supposed to be going heavy. That's why I kind of just want to thug this shit out. My gym be doing events like every every uh, weekend, every Saturday most of the time. I go to MPG Fitness. A lot of y'all be asking me. I go to MPG Fitness. I have it tagged on my Instagram and stuff. But today they're doing like free day passes. Like anyone and their mother can just walk in and it's free. So this bitch about to be busy as hell hopefully my homie texted me though he just got there and he said he's saving me a platform and a bar what a real one what a real one y'all got homies that be doing that shit for you bro this ken carson album a great chaos holy fuck how you go 18 for 18 that shit is fire i don't care what anyone says what's y'all favorite what's y'all favorite album of the year and if you do listen to Ken Carson, what's your favorite song off the album? I think my favorite album of the year, I'm not gonna lie, it's gotta be, it's gotta be Pink Tape, only because Uzi released so many grailed songs that like we've been wanting for years, or Ken Carson's A Great Chaos, bro, because this shit is fire. My favorite song off A of Great Chaos has to be probably jennifer's body or singapore bro singapore there's like four i really like jennifer's body singapore fighting demons and rockstar lifestyle anyways i'll see y'all at the gym bro there's literally nowhere to put the fucking camera in my car because this bitch is bulky as hell i love y'all though i'll see y'all soon hopefully hopefully we get some heavy shit lifted today we at the gym I ain't gonna lie, I'm not feeling like the GOAT. <laughs> but we gonna thug this shit out. I have no, I'm gonna keep it 102 this time. The last week four, bro, I failed both my lifts this day. Actually, no, I hit my deadlifts. But, bro, that shit, I was just like, bro, there's no way I'm gonna edit like an hour or two of footage of me just failing. That shit would have been such a, such a tragic YouTube video. But, I mean, unless y'all want to see shit like that, usually people get more hyped over like, oh my god, he hit a PR, oh my god, you know what I mean? It's like, who wants to see me fail and then sit there and just like lose all my energy and hope in my soul? Like, you could just see it. We got, we got work up to 315. Two twenty one type shit. Today we're testing if I can still bench three fifteen. Ah, uh, chat. I don't know if we gonna make it to three fifteen. This headache. I can start feeling it come when I brace really hard, and I have to like relax the brace a little bit. That way, I don't just fucking pass out. Just one, three, two, one. Yep. Oh yeah. Come on. Oh yeah. God damn. You're good at lift offs. That boy said yeah. <laughs> I, I like that. I'm bleeding a little. 
What happened? My chain cut the back of my neck. 287. 287. We're going to end at 315. So, I don't know. We're going to see how this moves. I literally, I thought I can like handle big jumps up to two reds. And then I thought I could keep handling big jumps. But every time I take big jumps past two reds, I just get folded. After two reds, we start taking the jumps smaller. Our gym just got a PR gong in, and like, if you about to go for a PR, you can hit that bitch, it's loud as fuck. Like, everyone watch. 303 to 315, the pipeline. I did 303 last week. The 287 moved like literally air, and then I went to 303, and that shit moved so ass. The fatigue caught up to That's me. That's weird, bro. Yeah. That's why I'm like doing smaller jumps now. Oh, damn. Oh my I'm nervous. <laughs> I mean, I know I'm gonna get it, but it's like, how fast is it gonna move? You overthink how fast you're gonna move it. I just gotta lock in. I ain't gonna lie. My last, my last shot, literally, my music was on like 20% volume. <laughs> it was like the dude was whispering in my ear. We're bringing, we're bringing the PR gong over. This big ass gong. <laughs> Is the PR gone? They about to ring this bitch, so it's like I have to hit it. If I fail it, I'm actually gonna kill myself. I don't know why I'm tweaking though. The 303 movie. I'm the embodiment of the overthinking power lifter, the tweaker power lifter, all that shit. This is gonna be my fourth time hitting 315, but I haven't touched this weight in like a month and a half. Come on, Dan. Come on, Dan. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. Oh, easy. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, yeah. I was. What the fuck? What the fuck? That shit was easy. Oh, that's oh that's my easy. God. That's Bro, 331. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Bro, I kind of want to go. That was not RPE 8. Nigga, that was six. So I'm going up. I'm going hey. up. Oh my god! That's okay. 315! What the fuck? Oh my god. I'm actually getting stronger. What the fuck? If I can hit 331 today, I'm taking it. I ain't gonna lie. I want that yellow so bad. And I don't wanna I don't wanna risk waiting next week and then I feel ass and then 331's not there. If it's there today, I'm taking it. I ain't gonna lie. I don't care if I overshoot. All right, I either hit this or I get folded and I get sad. <laughs> there's, there's no in between. All right, 331. I hit this or I kill myself. Go, oh, Dan. Come on, Dan. Come on. Come on, Come on, Dan. Come on, Dan. Come on. Up, 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 up. There we go. There we go. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What the fuck? I benched 331. No more 315 joke. What the fuck? That's crazy. What the fuck? Oh! <laughs> Why don't they nobody's fucking here? Honestly, I think it's easier to hit PRs when no one's here. There's like less pressure. Holy fuck. That wasn't even that hard. Holy yeah. fuck! Let's go! Let's Hell go! Yeah, boy. The fucking yellow fell. All right. Even though we hit that massive bench PR, I'm about to get fucked on the back down because it goes by percentages. I was not supposed to go that heavy today. I'm actually supposed to be doing 314 for five, but that shit is not happening. We're going to 308. I'm gonna probably still not hit this shit for five, but 
it's still gonna be a PR if I hit it for more than one, and I'm definitely going to. Come on. Push. Come on. Come on, Dan. Push, push, push. I'll take, three. I'll, okay. take, I'll take a 308 triple. I'll take that shit. Another, another gong hit. Two, one. Yep. A three PRs back to back is crazy. Someone must have put steroids in my food yesterday. This is insane. Y'all saw the intro footage. I did not feel that good today. I was just expecting to come in and hit 315 at max. Not that much sleep. I didn't eat good, if I'm going to be 100% honest, yesterday. Plus my neck. I don't know, man. It's like all the odds were almost stacked against me. You know what I mean? And I still... I still succeeded type shit. All right, this is my last set of this shit, and then we gonna see what I can cook on deadlifts. I, I had more, but the headache started coming back. I was like, no, I need a deadlift still. Uh, my lower back is fried too from all those heavy ass benches. That shit cooked me low key. I gotta look down though, because every time I be looking up, my neck pain comes back. Holy fuck. That shit felt like air. Here's the plan. We going four reds today. That shit felt easy. What the fuck? What the fuck? I met California just fucking slid my string. goes, bro, is that Dan? That Dan swore on the back. How do I? How do I send that video? Oh. There you go. Hello, Antonio. It is not Dan Swole, I'm his doppelganger. No, 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 my grip. No, no, it moves so easy, too. It moves so easy. I just gotta hold on to it. That's all I have to do. The strength is there. I'm gay. I can't grab it. Fuck! Bro, the strength, the strength is undeniably there. It's just, the grip is not there. I have a pair of dumbbells at home too. I'm about to just walk around the house holding them. Y'all, y'all see the vibe, you know? Not everything gonna go perfect. Sometimes you fail shit. Bench went insane though. Honestly, deadlifts went insane too. It's just my grip went out. What do y'all do to, to fix your hook grip? You know what I mean? Like, make it stronger and shit. Cause that's the only thing holding me back right now. Anywho. That is a day! That is a day of working out type shit. Bench PRs, back to back to back. Almost a deadlift PR, but it's whatever. I mean, I know the strength is there. It's just my grip isn't, you know what I mean? Anyways, time to go home, edit, post all that shit. You know the vibes. But yeah, that was honestly insane. That's like one of the best workout sessions I've had in a fat minute. It just goes to show like, y'all heard what I was saying going into it. I just like, that shit was weird. Everything was just clicking though. So you take that momentum and you build off of it. And when it's there, you got to capitalize. Y'all saw, man. I was pushing my luck even with deadlifts. I almost hit a, a deadlift PR too. Should I switch to mixed grip, chat? It's like, should I switch to mixed grip and never have to deal with that again? My grip's holding me back. And on some crazy shit, I swear to God, I went through this before. I've went through like plateaus on deadlift like two other times on grip. And when I finally got my grip together the last time, I can remember off the top of my head, I ended up like my grip was clicking that day and I ended up hitting like a 45 pound 
Oh, uh, deadlift PR. Who knows like what I can actually deadlift if I was able to hold on to the bar. You know what I mean? I love y'all. Thank y'all for the support. I be reading all the comments too. So let me know if y'all got any questions, anything you want to see. The vlogs are coming back.